The Voyager spacecraft have been working tirelessly for decades, helping scientists to better understand space and our own solar system. Recently, Voyager sent a terrifying message back to Earth as it explores deep space. So what did Voyager find and should we be concerned? Let's find in this video. Before we begin, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Turn on the bell for the latest notifications and updates. With that said, let's dig right into today's content. The Voyager spacecraft Voyager 1 and 2 respectively were initially launched to study the planets deep within our solar system. The probes were sent to study Jupiter and Saturn and their moons and other natural satellites. Since then, the probes have sent us valuable information helping scientists make new discoveries about Jupiter's moons and Saturn's rings. These discoveries have helped us better understand planets that were earlier far from our reach. By 2012, Voyager 1 had entered almost out of the heliopause and was about to enter interstellar space. By now, the probes have been active for decades, sending back valuable data and their new mission would be to better understand space beyond our solar system. A year later, by 2013, NASA announced that Voyager 1 had crossed the heliopause into interstellar space. Voyager had this become the first spacecraft to achieve this feat. Voyager 2 was right behind Voyager 1 and became the second spacecraft to cross into interstellar space in November 2018. This means that a one-way signal sent to Voyager 1 takes an estimated 21.5 hours to get there. To put this in relative terms, it means that the signals are traveling a distance of 14 billion miles away from Earth. From recent data collected, Voyager 1 was moving with a speed of 61,185 kilometers per hour and was 23.3 billion kilometers from the Sun, which is a distance of 14.6 billion miles away from Earth. The Voyager 2 probe was moving at a velocity of 55,335 kilometers per hour and was 19.4 billion kilometers from the Sun, a distance of 12.1 billion miles away from Earth. Isn't that mind-blowing? The latest information about the robotic interstellar probes in August 2022 is that Voyager 1 is currently speeding in space at a speed of 17,000 kilometers per second, according to the NASA Jet Propulsion Laboratory. However, since both interstellar probes have crossed the heliopause into deep space, there have been some issues recorded by Voyager 1 and a terrifying message was sent to the scientists back at NASA. Recently, the certified space SORA has been orbiting in space for the past 45 years. And as it keeps progressing, moving further into deep space with its system operations, scientists observe that the iconic spacecraft Voyager 1 has issued a couple of strange system data. With the readout coming from the attitude, articulation, and control system of the spacecraft, it seems that the movements of the spacecraft and its orientation were not in alignment. This further brought about the theory that Voyager 1 is unclear about its location in space. This assumption was made because the articulation and control system of the spacecraft AACS is what enables the spacecraft to send data about the environment it is to NASA, and now it has failed to send the correct data. This became a significant concern. A mystery like this is sort of par for the course at this stage of the Voyager mission, says Suzanne Dodd, who started working at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in California as a project manager on the Voyager 1 and 2 spacecraft right as she graduated out of college in 1984. She said further, the spacecraft are both 45 years old, which is far beyond what the mission plan has prepared them for. When Voyager 1's twin, the Voyager 2 probe, was checked, tests and data returned from Voyager 2 show that its system operations are normal. From the data that the scientists at NASA gathered, they saw that Voyager 1's attitude articulation and control system is sending data that is randomly generated. The data does not explain the actual details of what is happening on board the interstellar probe. Of all the three systems on Voyager 1, the computer system is the one that controls the orientation of the spacecraft, such as keeping the spacecraft's antenna pointed towards Earth in order to ensure the data from Voyager 1 keeps coming back to NASA. And it's also the same computer that deals with controlling the thrusters of the spacecraft. Dodd says, Only the telemetry signal does not make any sense and it's producing either all zeros or the number 377. But since the system issue hasn't made the old spacecraft go into safe mode, all is still well with the spacecraft. If the spacecraft was in degrading conditions, 
we would definitely receive a signal from the probe which they didn't see. Diagnosing the problem on Voyager 1 comes in two steps. First is finding the root cause of the issue, which would lead to the next steps to be taken. The steps include resetting the space probe software or switching to a backup hardware. One thing that is certain, however, is that Voyager 1 would continue to be operational. Well, that's all for this video. Hope you enjoyed watching this one. Thanks for watching.